Hi, how's it going? Today I'm going to be doing a video on a product made by Traction Grips. This is going to be an installation slash review video. Okay, the product that I'm going to be showing you are some grips. They're adhesive rubberized grips. They're going to be for this uh, Smith & Wesson SD40VE. All right. And uh, I reached out to Donald, and Donald uh, asked me what grips I needed for a gun, and he threw them right there in the mail for me, and I got them within uh, a few days. Okay, so uh, let me go ahead and take out the product here and show you what it looks like when it comes to you. Okay, there it is right there. has the different models that it's for on the package. Okay, then on the back, this has a little instructions on the back side. Okay, and there's your grip. And there's a little um, little pad right there that you can uh, use as well if you want to. Go ahead and uh, pull this out. And I'll show you all the instructions real quick. There's the instructions. If you want to look at that and see if that's something you think you can handle, it's very simple. Um, and they don't take very long to install. Okay. Here's the grip itself. Nice little cutout. Very easy to install. Again. And there's a little piece right here. This is a piece that goes up under your trigger guard. Right here. I guess you can put it there or you can put it right there if you wanted to. But that gives you a good, uh, when you grip your gun, a uh, place where your hand can rest, you know, and get you some good traction on the weapon. I don't use mine, okay? That's just me. Um, the instructions say to use soapy water, hot water, and clean all the areas where the grips are going to be um, applied. I didn't want to bore you with that, and I actually use alcohol. I take a little alcohol and put it on this uh, cotton swab. And I just uh, run it around all the areas and then I dry it with a blow dryer and I'll do that real quick here. Alright. Alright, I didn't want to bore you too much with that so I went ahead and did that earlier. So what I do now, normally I take this and I put it on the, the gun just to get a feel of where it's going to be. And get a look at it, just like so. So I know how I'm going to stick it on the gun. And you can see where it's cut out around the um, mag release there and it's cut out around the mag release there as well okay so then what I do I go ahead and take this off and you try not to touch the sticky part as much as you can you know uh, avoid touching that but if you do it's not that big of a deal it's not like it's gonna mess anything up or you can't it won't stick to the gun so I remove it like so Then, I go ahead and place it on the weapon. I was going backwards there for a second. Got to pay attention to what I'm doing, huh? Alright, so I just stick it about right there on the gun. Then I just... uh moving around a little bit until I see exactly where I want it touch it in a few places where it kind of sticks then I check it wrap it around I see it's over too far on the other side so what I do I just move that thing up a little bit here go ahead and uh, place it right here
Okay. Line that up. Wrap that around. Now it's pretty close there. Pretty close there. Actually can move it just a hair more up. Now if you're like me, I try to be a perfectionist. And I hate that, but you know, I want my product to look good. When I install it. And there, I got it too far up. So, it doesn't take long if you not a perfectionist but again you want it looking right and looking good when you put it on there all right I think I'm getting somewhere now there wrap it around like so splush right there there we go now I just rub it all down make sure the whole area is nice and smooth on the gun okay on the grip all the way down here make sure it's where I want it I've got it where it's nice and uh, smooth then what you do now is you take it I mash mine around real good get a good feel on it looks good on both sides to me and then I heat it up with this blow dryer okay I'm going to go ahead and move this paper towel and this out of the way before I just blow it all out of the way. I'm not going to bore you to death with this. I'll leave a little bit on here and then I'm going to cut it and uh, you know, show you the finished product. But that's what you do. You just heat this up on high until it's nice and uh, hot. Okay. Alright, as you heat it up, you kind of mash all down in here, and it's going to get pretty dang hot, okay? And that's what you want. You want to get good and hot, where you can mash all that tape down all around in these nice little grooves and everything like that. So it gets a good, good um, feel to it, and it sticks in all these crevices real nice, okay? All right, well, I'm going to finish it up, and then I'll show you the finished product, okay? I'm back. I didn't want to bore you to death with that hair dryer going on for so long. It only took, actually, about five minutes to do. I like to heat it up all around the edges here. Make sure the edges are nice. Anywhere you've got, like, a hump or something like that, like here you've got a little hump right here where the mag release is on the opposite side okay so I wanted to push all that down real good all up under the trigger guard all around the side and you can see I've heated up enough where you know it even goes down into the original uh, grooves of the grip all the way around here and uh, and that's it you know it takes about a good 10 minutes to do the whole process but for you know 11 twelve dollars something like that this is a great addition to your gun again these are made by traction grips and uh, you can find them either on their website or you can find them on ebay and on amazon okay i will leave links below so you can get to their uh... website but a uh, great product i love the uh... texture it's not over aggressive like the sandpaper type. It's kind of a rubbery, uh, rubber grippy texture and it feels good. Okay, I add them to most of my weapons and you can't go wrong with it. Great addition for, like I said, a little over $10. Okay, so check them out if you're into grips. I know uh, they make grips just about for any hunt handgun out there. 
and it's a great company to do business with great customer service I've had to call them a couple times and uh, they've uh, worked with me and helped me out okay so uh, give them a shot check them out if you're looking into uh, some nice adhesive grips for uh, you know a great price alright thanks for watching please like and subscribe leave any comments down below bye